2020, the world economy suffered the disastrous effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. International trade, considered as the engine of the global growth over the last decades, and exchanges of manufactured goods registered a heavy contraction. The crisis concerned both the industrialized and the emerging countries, with the only exception of China. The United States were able to contain the fall, whereas the United Kingdom reported one of the worst performances. In Japan and in the Eurozone, the economic activity had a drastic downturn. The GDP fall of the Euro area was due to the decrease reported by all major countries, starting from Germany and France. Italy was able to keep up better than other important European countries, such as Spain and the United Kingdom. In 2020, the world production of machine tools collapsed below 59 billion euro. Asia confirmed to be the first area with regard to contribution to the world production of the sector, followed by Europe. The Americas were far behind. A strong decline was also highlighted in world consumption, which stood at 57 billion euro. European demand suffered the heaviest reduction. The Americas showed a strong fall, whereas the Asian area registered a more moderate decrease. International trade also reported a remarkable cut to its usual value. In 2020, China was once again at the top of the world ranking of machine tool manufacturing countries, followed by Germany, Japan and Italy. The United States ranked fifth. In the ranking of the major exporting countries, Germany was in first place, followed by Japan, China and Italy. Taiwan came in fifth. Considered, on the whole, i.e. by adding up the values of machine tools, robots and automation systems, in 2020 the Italian production of the sector dropped to a little more than 5 billion euro. If besides the production of machines, we also consider that of parts, tools, numeric controls and services to machines, the economic value of the sector amounts to 7.5 billion euro. The order index showed a negative trend, going down by 18.6% on a yearly average, minus 35.1% domestic orders, minus 13.6% foreign orders. A strong contraction in domestic demand penalized Italian manufacturers and even more importers. The market share covered by foreign supply decreased by 5 points versus 2019. Just like the other indicators, even exports had a heavy fall due to the restrictions to the mobility of goods and people. Trade balance was also on the decrease. The negative performance of the Italian industry of the sector affected the utilization level of production capacity, whose yearly average decreased by 17 percentage points. The order portfolio also highlighted a considerable reduction. In 2020, Italian exports of machine tools only, i.e. excluding robotics and automation, went down compared with the previous year. The trend was particularly negative in the first semester and then improved in the second part of the year. The most important export market for Italian production were the United States, followed by Germany, China, France and Poland. 
In 2020, the weight of Italian exports on consumption, expressed by the main markets, generally grew. Italian shares dropped only in China and Russia. A percentage of 45.9% of Italian exports was directed to the countries of the European Union. The sales of Made by Italians decreased everywhere in Germany, France, Poland, Spain and the United Kingdom. There was a downturn in the weight of Asia, where sales absorbed 18.5% of total exports. The largest part was destined for East Asia. The general fall did not concern Taiwan, where sales were on the rise. Sales to the Middle East were on the decrease. Sales to South Asia went down. Deliveries to the Asian area were more than halved. Sales to North America covered 18.3% of total exports, actually equaling the value of the deliveries destined for Asia. Deliveries to non-EU European countries, stable in fourth place in the ranking of export areas, represented 11.6% of the total. The purchases of Italian machine tools also fell in South America, which acquired 2.1% of total exports. The weight of Africa dropped absorbing only 2.4% of the total. A completely different trend is highlighted in 2021, for which a remarkable growth is expected for all main economic indicators of the Italian and worldwide industry of the sector.